What's up, YouTube? I'm Kathleen. I'm David. Welcome to Out of Box Collector, where we unbox and review different kinds of collectibles. So we have a treat for all of you anime fans today, mm -hmm. specifically My Hero Academia fans, yeah. because we will be unboxing the first wave of My Hero Academia Pops. Yeah. This pop was released way back in 2017, but it's also re-released uh, recently. So you'll last be able year, to yeah, yeah, last year and this year, if I'm not oh. mistaken. So you'll still be able to buy these pops uh, in stores, mm -hmm. except for Tenya. So this one, uh, they kept this blotted uh, ever since. So good luck hunting to you guys for this one. Anyway, you can still buy the rest of the first wave. So let's start unboxing the figures. So we'll start with with Deku, mm -hmm. the main character from My Hero Academia. Mm -hmm. I actually w wasn't really into this anime, but mm -hmm. you made me watch it, and now I'm hooked. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so the suit that Deku is wearing here was the one that he designed, yep. and it was made by his mom. So you can see he even has his mask around his neck and he is in he is in an action pose and I really like that they did his hair like this. Yeah the sculpt is really good. And yeah because that's what his hair looks like in the cartoon. Mm -hmm. The next is All Might, another one of the main characters yeah. in my hero actor. So this is All Might in his full superhero gear in his tra trademark superhero blue, red, white, and yellow colors. It's a pretty Stay big here. pop compared to Deku because that's what he really looks like in the cartoons. He's much bigger than Deku in the cartoons. Yeah, actually, and in all of them actually. He's actually bigger <laughs> than most of the students. Right. It's, a very, it's a very detailed pop and his eyes is actually uh, shiny. So it's actually quite nice. Yeah. I hope all pops. Uh, I hope oh, all yeah. pops. They do all pops like him. Yeah. That was his not. Okay, yeah. I didn't notice that. <laughs> yeah. So yeah. his uh, belt is also in metallic silver, which is good. And his back is also very detailed. And the top is really fantastic. It's one of the best pops uh, from this line, uh, in my in my opinion. And yeah. The next one is Katsuki Bakugo. This is Deku's rival. Okay, so this is Katsuki Bakugo, also in his superhero attire. You can see that he's wearing his what do you call it? Yes. Uh, his grenade. Uh, grenade. Or something. Or something. <laughs> but it looks like a grenade because. His power is actually explosion, yes. so he can use his uh, sweat to create. Uh, uh, he can he can create explosions using his sweat. So mm -hmm. he uses those gloves to to explode things bigger. Yes, and his hair also like Deku's. Yes, yeah. it's really well sculpted. Yes, it just looks a bit uh, unfinished. Because it doesn't have paint, but that's what his hair really looks like yes, in the cartoons. The cartoons. Yeah. His hair in the cartoons is it's, uh, it's blonde. Yeah, it's blonde. So it looks like that it's not painted, but there's a little bit of difference uh, from the paint that they used on his hair and his face. Yeah. It's a very detailed pop too, considering mm -hmm. that the body is a, it's a little bit smaller than this one. But it really looks like him. So that's Katsuki Bakugo. Okay, so now we'll go to the one of the grails in this wave. So this is Tenya. Uh, it's a pretty expensive pop nowadays, so I'll be taking, I'll be a little bit careful on the box of this one. <laughs> uh, I got, I did not buy this at um, what do you call this? At SRP. So I bought it in a in an aftermarket price, but it's okay. <laughs> Okay, so this is Tenya. So this is, it's actually quite, uh, it's a simple pop, but he's in an action running pose. Because uh, his, uh, what do you call it? His, power, his quirk is actually speed, so he has an uh, engine for legs. 
and he's in a he he looks like as if he's about to run. Um, oops. Um, he's wearing his glasses. Glasses. So this is his also this is his uh first costume. It hasn't been upgraded yet, and uh, it's a really nice pop. So if you like Tanya, he is actually a must-have for this line for you to complete. But like I said, he's already a grail piece. And uh, happy hunting to you guys. <laughs> Good luck. Good luck to you guys. So the last one, oh, I'll open the figure. This is one of the cutest pops actually from the My Hero Academia line. And this is what she looks like. She comes with a stand, but she can actually stand really well on her own. Yeah, but let's put her in her stand. Anyway. This is a chuckle. She's in her signature pose, uh, like this, when she's about to use her quirk. Yes. Uh, the, uh, what do you call that? She uses a gravity uh, on something. So she does that pose. And uh, I think she's really cute. They really captured mm -hmm. uh, her likeness from the cartoons. And I think this is one of the cutest among the wave one. This is a fantastic line if you're a fan of My Hero Academia. And uh, who's your favorite among the five pops? My favorite is All oh Might yeah. <laughs> because he stands out among all of these five and um, I really like that they captured his real superhero form. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I, li I like the colors of his superhero costume. He's, he's the biggest. Yeah. He really stands, he stands out. out. He really stands out. He's also my favorite, by the way. He really stands out. As you can see from his T-shirt. Yeah, that's good, right? Yeah. <laughs> so you can see, uh, you can see him right away when you look at them on shelves. Oh, by the way, there's an All Might Glow in the Dark released in 2017. That's also a Grail, so it's a bit expensive nowadays. There's also an SDCC uh, 2017 Ochako mask, which, of course, we actually failed to buy one that time. Because we haven't watched, we haven't yes. started to watching the cartoons yet. We just started watching it recently. Yes, so we kind of backtracked. We got me hooked. Yeah, we're hoping to get those wheels sometime in the near future. So we'll be sharing it to you guys once we get them. I really want the mask uh, Ochako because it looks so cute. <laughs> yeah, it really is. Actually, this one is, is it actually a yes, good, it is. Yeah, a good alternative if you really couldn't yeah. find one. So, yeah, it's a fantastic line to collect if you love the show. But if you're just getting hooked, uh, mm -hmm. I suggest starting with the with your favorite heroes first. Uh, and like I said earlier, you can still get the four pops uh, in stars right now. And of course, Tenya will be the most difficult one to get because uh, he's already bought. So what do you think of the My Hero Academia Wave 1 Pops? Which one is your favorite among the five? Let us know at the comment section below. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. Yeah. And please subscribe if you haven't yet. That's pretty much it for us. Thank you very much for watching. And remember, free your pops, pops and box your toys. toys.